But just going on from that, you, you know, and I, I guess ZP is not really a new vocalist anymore. He's been in a couple of years, but he seems, from a fan's perspective, he seems to have brought with him a lot of, you know, positive energy and enthusiasm. And, you know, obviously always big shoes to fill, but a lot of positive energy. Boy, you're not kidding. I mean, it's uh, it's such a welcome change. Um he uh, he is just a naturally a positive guy. Um, I know him only for the last few years, um, and it's really difficult to find that guy in a bad mood. And he is one of those people who has such a positive outlook on everything. Uh, it's infectious. It has a great effect on those around him. And, um, he seems to be always about the group, like what's best for, for all of us. Not, not what's best for me mm-hmm. as a singer of Skid Row, as ZP. It's like, what can we do to, you know, to make Skid Row, uh, more visible, more, uh, relevant, more, you know, um, accessible, more successful and and it's always about you know us what can we do it's never about it's never singular Mm. um he's not self-serving at all and he's also is extremely respectful of our of our history and does his best to honor that every night on stage I, i admire that a lot um you know people could take this position and they could utilize it strictly for their own personal gain and you know and not be concerned with about the 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 leg- the legacy or the longevity of the band itself uh it's not a springboard for his ego it's a uh it's an outlet for his uh for his art 